What's up everybody? So we're out in the shop and in this episode we're going to take a scrap piece of steel, this guy right here, and we are going to forge that into a knife. Now this is not a piece of steel that people would typically think about forging into a knife because of how small this little area is here, but I'm going to end up using this for the tang and it's not, you know, it's not very big yet, but we're going to do some stuff to, to make this a useful tang and then we're going to forge all of this into the blade. Now I've got two different directions that I'm thinking about going with this blade and I don't know which one I'm going to go with just yet. I'm going to start forging, seeing how the steel starts moving and then decide which way I want to go with it. But I figured I would go ahead and do this and by the way, this is the same day upload. It is nine o'clock in the morning on Sunday, which is today, the day you're going to be seeing this. I'm going to forge this whole entire uh, profile and everything and then edit it and then release it and try and have that done by about noon. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> but I figured I would do this because I'm still working on the handle skills for the two insanity builds and I wanted y'all to be able to see something and I had planned on forging this anyways and I'm trying to get as much of that forging stuff done before I start taking down the uh, the shop where all the forge stuff is so yeah. Y'all just sit back, relax, and enjoy this little build.
All right, guys, let's go ahead and wrap this one up right here. Check that out. So this is what we were able to forge out of that piece of steel that was only like this long. So it, it was only this big of a piece of steel. We were able to get all of this extra length out of it, uh, good size handle out of it by doing that distal taper without the tang there. But forging in our bevels, doing all the profile, and being able to get something that big out of that piece of steel is just awesome. And uh, the stuff that I try and practice is whenever I'm forging something that is going to be this heavily forged, you know, smushing it, lengthening it, doing all that stuff, being able to have a nice straight spine, straight cutting edge, everything looking really good and smooth, even with my rough forge texture that I do on the tops, that is awesome. I, I love that process. I love that I'm getting comfortable enough with forging that I can keep everything nice and straight so that I'm not having to spend all of that time on the grinder taking imperfections out of the build. You know, it, the, the more you can practice with your hammer, the more or the less work you have to do later. And that's what I've been doing. That's why I do so many of these little scrap builds. But I want to know, do y'all like it whenever I take the scrap pieces of steel and turn them into knives? Are, are y'all interested in me doing stuff like that? I want to hear some feedback, so let me know down in the, the comment section, but this is awesome. Being able to get that big of a knife out of that piece of steel is just, that's where it's at right there. Now, stuff that I still need to do to this, of course, is drill holes in the tang for the pins for the handle. I've got to heat treat it. I've got to finish grinding it. I'm not going to bring the bevels up much higher than that, but i got to finish grinding it, and then, of course, put the handles on put the edge on it, do all that stuff. And I'll probably go ahead and do that in another video where I just completely finish the knife and make it nice and easy for y'all. But there we go. I'm super excited about that. I think it's a really cool build. And how about this? I'm gonna do this for y'all. I'm gonna finish this knife this week while I'm still working on the handle scales for the Insanity build and I'm gonna release the second part of this video on Friday. So, yeah, we'll do that. I know I'm putting a lot on myself deciding to do this because I'm about to start another knife build, but I'm up for the challenge. So we're gonna go ahead and do that, finish this build this week, and y'all will get that video on Friday. So, yeah, there you go. Guys, thank y'all for coming by. If y'all would, give this video a thumbs up. Share this video or one of my other videos if you haven't yet. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Y'all have an amazing day. Y'all stay safe out there. I'll catch y'all next time.